Welcome back to Mega Man and Forte. I mean Bass. No, it's Rockman and Bass. Right. No, sorry, Rockman and Bass. That's it. We got it, finally. No, it's Lakuman and Basu. How can I hurt people more? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to make a fishing pole noise, but I don't know how to make one that is easily identifiable as a fishing pole. Well, I think the, 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 the from a video I saw earlier today, all you have to do is take that level 70 Reaper weapon that's just basically <laughs> a scythe chainsaw. Scythe chainsaw? Yeah, it's mean? literally... It literally is just Taking like... Taking a nod from GU? <laughs> it might as well be, because it's literally just a... You take it off, and next thing you hear is like... It's <laughs> the motor kicks off, and you see the little teeth going <laughs> and everything. And my first thought... When this I, is GU! And my first thought when I did I saw that was... This is just Cars' thing. <laughs> Where he's just like, I got a blade on my arm. But if you look really close, it's like a little chainsaw. <laughs> Anyway. anyway, yes. So we, last time we played through the intro, and then we beat up um, Cold Man, a popsicle. Yeah, who, who, who kicked my butt two times, and he's the easy robot master. So, admittedly, like we're going into this blind. Oh yeah, effectively. I'm, I and, have not played this game at all, and I haven't played Mega Man in a while, so my skills are beyond rusty. Yeah, and I feel like once you got it down, he wasn't that bad. It's just a matter of figure, and that's how it goes with most robot masters. So Pretty I much. will, I will withhold my judgment on the robot masters for now because that didn't feel that bad. You are about to regret that because we're oh, I'm going, sure because we're going into Burner Man stage. Also, psycho. Unhinge your jaw for that one. He's a psychopath. He likes to burn for things. I think he literally likes to burn forest, because that's why we're in the forest. And one of the stage hazards that you will not fucking like in this whole thing is, hey, how about if we took the whole forest and just basically turned the bottom section on fire? That's instant death if you touch it. Cool. Yeah, it's Don't not remember any other Mega Man games where just regular old fire was instant death, but here we are. I feel like there's some, but it's definitely one of those moments of like... Not like Did lava? Sure, like lava? Sure. I've never seen just fire be insta that. Wait. Sounds like a remix of one of the other Robot Masters themes. Probably is. Given this whole game is kind of just a... a remix. Admittedly, they put a lot of effort into it for it being a remix. Oh, no, I like... This. That's the thing, it's like... Difficulty aside, I really kind of like it. Also, this we're gonna be dealing with that a bunch. Like, there's a lot, it, there's a neat, a lot of neat ideas here with the level progression, being able to backtrack to previous stages to get stuff. Like, there's a lot of neat ideas here. I don't like Gorilla Man here. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to do about that other than maybe there's probably. A oh, you can just hit him from there. That's cool. There's probably way smarter ways to do it, but it's also like, I'm playing Mega Man base. There was no smart decisions made in this boardroom. I mean, I was thinking maybe using Ice Man's. Oh, the ice wall? Yeah. Yeah, uh, maybe. Can but... you use that, like, up top, maybe, and shove it down and hit him with it? Nah, I don't have the space for it there. Yeah, probably. You'd have to, like, run over and form it on top of him or something. Thanks, I hate it. Oh, I was gonna say just scoot to the edge so it just drops on his head. I could keep moving, or it could be a vindictive bitch. <laughs> what happens if you uh, charge shot that thing in his hands? I think he just blows up and he goes like, oh. Where's he getting them from? They just frame, zero frame appear in his hands. You're not even going to give him, like, a little animation of the thing appearing or something? I'm more annoyed at the fact that they take, apparently, two charge, two charge shots to take care of. And it's just one of those, like, listen, I know you wanted to imbalance the charge shot because you kind of went like, uh-oh, they got something really big here. Do we really have to imbalance it that much?
like, I've always kind of... I've had kind of a problem with the charge shot, and I've mentioned this before, because it feels like it got to the point where... It was a little too much. Like, it was... It was powerful, and then they scaled enemy HP to account for that. They just noped me out of there. Yeah, be, um, and then they scaled... They, so they made it real powerful, and then they scaled enemy HP to account for that. But what that did was effectively invalidate the lemon. Like, if you weren't charge-shotting an enemy, you might as well not even be shooting them. So that's the biggest reason that I didn't like the charge shot. And I feel like the first game that the charge shot was in, it was nice. Because it was just kind of... If you have the chance to build up a charge shot, maybe you're going into a new room, or you have a stretch of empty space, then go ahead, and it'll give you a little advantage going into the next, or up against the next enemy or something. But then after that, it kind of became, yeah, just charge shot everything. But then if they go, okay, the charge shot is too strong, we need to give everybody, like, more HP, that doesn't work, now everything is tanky and everything is useless. Unless you want to use, like, unless you really want to emphasize special weapons or something. Yeah, the point was you didn't have to emphasize the special weapons. They were just there because. Okay, so use him to determine where ground is. That is ground in the middle. Oh, that's also a good idea. Yeah, it's like the bubble beat. Or is it that doesn't lead? take a lot of juice either. Take that. Really? I mean, there's no room to jump. So I'm kind of not surprised. Well, yeah. I don't know how you're supposed to get that one. You're supposed to do that. That seems like a shockingly wide hole. Shoot an ice wall in there. I mean, it's just gonna go... I mean, it will, but that is a long hole. You ain't getting that. I think the whole point is you ice wall and then jump up into it. Maybe. But I have no patience for it. Yeah, because you're not getting to that from... Because I literally have to do this moment. Fun fact, you can kill one of these, but the other one just goes like... <laughs> it's not so bad here. You just have to... Don't you get a move that, like, goes out... Like, like you shoot and it goes out and fetches stuff? Like the friggin' search yeah. bees or whatever? It's search bees. I think it's Magic Man's thing. How many lemons does he take? Okay, so the charge beam is just crap powerful is what it is. Also, these guys have a lot more HP than they have any right to have. Also, I like Mega Man's like uh, put them uh, up, put them up. Oh, spooky. Very mean. I think I can, yeah, I can yeah, stay I think you here. stand right there and shoot him. I don't know if this is, I know he's, this one's from this, this little boss, uh, this uh, robot's from, like, Mega Man 8, because I definitely remember these guys, but I keep thinking it's like, Oh, if I'd been thinking guts? about it, if I'd been thinking about it, I would, I wanted to, like, actually test how many charge shots of V-Lemons it took to kill him. Oh, yeah, this part. Oh, yeah, just, you know, get stabbed. Just random spears coming out.
What does this have to do with fire? I think technically we're in a jungle. So they're doing that whole, like, oh, the natives have spears. And it's like, okay. Okay. Could we maybe see someone that's using a spear? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eh. Every time you say, I'm going to do something stupid and I know it's going to kill me, you live. Every single time in the ten years we've been making videos. I know I'm gonna get killed, but... See? There, bro, bad streak. <laughs> Yay! I, I don't want to bother. I guess somebody else wants to get their things, they can get their oh. things. Oh, at least you die in one shot, that's... Ooh, ooh. So are these... They're effectively Medusa heads? Well, they're not as bad because... They're not doing the wave pattern thing. Yeah. Shots go through walls too, which is amazing. I think it's the other thing he has over base is that his shots go through the walls. Um, I don't think that's hard. No! Ah! Hey, look at that. Something we can't do. Nice job, Mega Man. Just chilling here. Don't mind me. Hey, 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 remember that thing I mentioned about the fire things? Oh boy, this level feels like it's ten levels long. There you go. That's the, uh, that's the fire pit right here. And it doesn't get easier. That problem. Black Ops. Because it's a jungle. It's a jungle out there. Die! Die! Mega Man's lost it. Ogre's lost it. Mega Man's fine. Mega Man's a hero, but just a justice hero. That's right, justice hero. That's what he is. Yup. <laughs> I don't think there. I think the next fire guy comes if you take the top path. You have to like slide under him. Come anyway. Oh, Clip your forehead. Watch you. So I to He dropped a big one. Where the? Oh, it's gone already. Oh. No, keep shooting straight up into nothingness. That makes it easier to kill you. Oh boy. We're at Burn Man. Slow part. motion oh dragon. Oh boy. <laughs> that was the other appeal of Mega Man was the fact that, you know, you can farm shit if you want to. Yeah. Alright, let's try it with my pitiful amount of ice walls. Okay. Oh, see, oh, this is a pain in the butt fight, too. Well, uh, see, here's the worst thing about this guy is that, um, well, there's that. Well, he does that. You know what? We're gonna just gonna continue. I know it's gonna be a heck of a thing to edit, but, uh, we need to. We'll figure something out. Cool. That guy looks kind of like that truck. That's probably what they based him off of. Alright, let's try this again. So why is there a Chinese dragon in the middle of a jungle fort, jungle fire level? I think we're in Vietnam. So, hey, want to know a couple things that's annoying about this boss? Okay. So, Ice Wall's his weakness. Mm -hmm. You got that right. Yep. It, ma it, ma it makes sense in the Mega Man thing. Fire boss, ice weapon. Eh. Mm -hmm. It's like, you think, like, wouldn't it be water? And it's like, technically, I guess it freezes it, but, you know, yeah, that whole, we're not going to go over that whole thing. See, when they say it's his weakness, it is. But not because but, you want to hit him with it. Yeah. But it's because you want to knock him into the spikes with it that are his actual damage things. I think you can still Mega Buster him to death. Do not quote me on that, because I don't think it's... I don't know if you can or not. I don't think anybody's ever really tried. And if they have, it's probably not fun. 
But here's the other thing that's annoying about it, and what makes it the worst to deal with. He has to be on screen when he does it. Oh. So it's not that he has to take the damage. He has to be on screen to take the damage. So that little bit where I pushed him, I had to chase him because if he didn't take that damage on screen, it wouldn't have counted. Also, I think he hits the most, like, vulnerable, like, moments of, like, I have no vulnerability, so I can't be damaged by this thing. I'm not seeing a buster-only run of this game. But I'm also not going to spend forever looking. And I killed him. He's dead. Take that. Gold man died twice. Burner man, kill him in one go. It's not that he takes the most... It's not his, like, the spikes are his weakness. It's that he takes a lot of damage and you want to do that to him. Mm. But it's also like, wow, that's the weirdest thing to program, that you have to push the robot into the spikes, but he has to be on screen to take the damage. Yeah, like, it's neat, but it's also a real weird quirk. And kind of... In the engine of Mega Man... I understand oh why. Look how many bolts I got. I got 410 just because of that. Like, in the engine of Mega Man, I understand why. Yeah, because it's, the, it's the, probably the same like the reasoning for the respawning enemies. Yeah, and how you can't shoot an enemy that's just a little bit off screen. Like, the engine probably just stops paying attention to things entirely when they're off screen. So, like, I understand that. But then why would you program a boss in that is so easily falls to an engine quirk? I have no clue. Did I pick up any new ones? I don't think I did. Oh, Slash, Slash Man. Slash. Slash Man. Leads the dinosaur. Dinosaur. Wow. Yeah, every he, kid, every yeah that was the dinosaur level. Every kid's best friend. His speed was set too high for his allies. I'll scurry you with my claws. My claw. Ups. Dexterous. Downs. Hard to control. Likes. Fruits and vegetables. Hates. Nail cutters. I feel you. I feel you, Robot Wolverine. If I got any more, it's a miracle. Nope. So hey, we opened up... Pirate Man. Well, Pirate Man was already opened up, but we opened up this weird thing. I wonder what this is all about. Looks like boss refights. It is not. You would think so. That but... looks a lot like a boss refight. Didn't want to do that. Was going to go to the other side. Hey, you can save here. Don't know why I saved. I didn't need to. Anything. But no, these aren't boss refights. These are something completely different if I can find out the one I'm looking for. Hey, here we go. That's probably another one. I think it's because the base is burner is green for some reason. Uh, oh, yeah, here's one. Bunk, bunk, bunk. Now that, we get... That is a big bolt. Yep. God. A hundred bolts from that. Hmm. So this is where you go to get bolts. You thought it was the end of the game. No, it's a bolt depository. Yeah, the thing is that they're only, like... I think they're a one-time deal. You can't get them again. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I would guess... I mean, if they wanted to be kind, this is where you come to farm bolts, but... Also, here's the thing. Um, this is how you get into uh, King's Fortress. You have to actually complete this. Okay, so you actually need all... Yep. You, you need actually... all weapons in order to get into King's Fortress. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. 
That's so, kind. That's kind of an interesting way of handling it's it. It's interesting. I think it's a little. It's like the rewards are nice. You get a hundred bolts from it, but it's also kind of like, do we really need to go through this? Because it's like, are you just setting me up for something else? Because there's one item that we need specifically from Auto Shop. Because oh boy, do we need it. But uh, you're not selling anything yet. Uh, I think it's only after a certain amount of Robot Masters. But, we're gonna get on to the new next Robot Master in this rotation. And it is, uh... Not who you'd think it would be, honestly. Because if I've learned anything about pirates, is that you need to burn them. Yeah, no, that's not what I would've thought of at all. Yeah, so we're going on to Pirate Man stage, because he is weak to burn, uh, burner wave. No, not, not at all what I would've thought of. It works differently than you think, trust me. Yeah, the water everywhere? Mm, nope. I would not have gone here and said, yeah, fire. I would have thought maybe electricity? Yeah, there is an electric boss in this game, so... But, uh, here's the thing. You can hurt this piece of crap. Yeah. Gotta be careful with that. It acts differently underwater. Hmm. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Thank you. Wait. I wanted to kill him. Because I'm a psycho -pain. I'm sure you can in at least one Mega Man game. Oh, there were a couple we could kill him in. Got health. That's all that matters. Ow. Lost that health. Oh, you're still going pirate and shits. I think those are insta kill things. Let me try something. I don't think it's gonna hurt a lot, but. The Mega Man is only weak to some spikes. See, Mega Man does have a weakness. Just like every other robot master. It's called death. It comes for us all. It spikes. Shocked that Wily hasn't built a spike man. Spike wall man. He did make it like a needle man or something. Yeah, but... But that's not quite the same thing. That's like these spikes. Not instant death, they just hurt. Gotta make a, gotta make a spike wall man. Go through the door, no floor, spikes on the floor. He doesn't like to die. May have to hit him from the other side. I don't want to deal with clams. I'm notoriously. <laughs> That's cool. It's buoyancy. Oop. Ice wall. I don't like these guys. Hard to tell how to work. Like, where do you hit? Okay, you just hit him in the front. Mm -hmm. For whatever reason, it felt like that didn't work. It didn't because, well. It didn't because of the fact that it was also, like... Hold up, my brain stopped. Because uh... it was on land, and once they get shot, they go into a rolling state. Well, I mean, like, even when it was underwater, I remember you shooting it in the face. Or at least I thought you did, and it felt like it just dinked off him. smart ideas, and then things went wrong. These are shockingly difficult to deal with. Okay. 
It does that sometimes, don't worry about it. Yeah, it's kinda like, was it just because I took it out by accident? No. No, the thing came away. Why is it sudden? I haven't done anything different. Whatever, I think there was... If there was, maybe I'll try to get it. Well... Where you going, buddy? Stop screen. Alright. He's back. <laughs> it's like he's dealing with cars. When you're a kid in the highway. Can you slide on that? Sure yeah, can. Yeah. Another, another whale. Yeah, I was gonna say, don't do it. Oh boy, this section. It's a mimic. Ah. Mimics are mean. Okay, just stop with the thing. I'm trying to get through this. Sorry, I don't like it. Oh. Uh. Bubble's gonna kill me. Oh, is this? Is it Pirate Man already? Is it? Like, I hope so. That last stage felt like it lasted ten years. There's like two stages in one. This actually feels like an appropriate stage. Unless this is going to be a mini boss or something. And then you go through a whole second half of a stage. Well, let's try it. I'm not going to use the burner because I'm probably going to get one shot. At... Yep, Pirate Man. Wow. That's like an. That was like an okay level. Well, it's mostly because I kind of went past a lot more than I really should have. But... Secretly Bubble Man. Well, I wanted to get that death out of the way because it was going to be a nightmare because I only have so much burner fuel to go through. Bubble Bubble Man. I'm a pirate man. I'm going to find the pirates. I don't know if you can just damage raise him. We'll see about that, bitch. It's like I'm not trying to, but the remote mind explosions stay longer than I care for. Yeah. And they count as a damage for me, and it's like annoying. There we go. Yar. Still not entirely sure My why... My treasure is yours for the taking. I left it all in one piece. Hey, Dr. Light, can we take some of this back with us? It could probably fund a lot. It's fake, Mega Man. Tar. Well, but why? Is it like home in on enemies? Yeah, I think it can home in. Cool, we gotta save. Okay, 610 bolts. Can we buy anything? 680 bolts. Hey, cool, we can do another thing. I gotta figure out where the remote mine is at. Is it one of the bottom ones? No, that's another Not one. Not that one. Sure, I have to go out of the light completely. Maybe? Can you aim them like. Nope. Maybe if you like go to the right and then jump and then aim up? No, no, I know what that is. Nope. Nope. That is somebody else. 
be nice if they just did something small, like made those Mega Man's colors. Hmm. Made, like, the crates or whatever. Oh, they also have to, I think, compensate for base as well. Because his color... Color scheme is different, and some of his attack colors are different as well. That still shouldn't be that hard, though. Like... Palette swapping is a thing on the Super Nintendo. You could just make those Mega Man's palette. I don't know if you're getting that thing over there. But I think this is the one I'm supposed to get. Okay, well, we're out anyway. We'll come back. We'll definitely got to Take a look at the there. other ones at least. Let's see if there's one that looks more like. Nope, nope, that is somebody else. I think this last one is just somebody else as well. I think that's one of those weird ones you just gotta get good with the patterns. Yeah, that one's probably, um, I think I know what that one is. What's the one down on the left? What left? It was lower left. Who's lower left? You're. Down Up one. Up. No. No. Oh. Oh, that was, uh, Cold Man's. We already did his. This, this one? one? Yeah, yeah, that's Cold Man. Okay. Alright, maybe Otto has something new. We'll see. Come on, Otto. Help us out. Hey, stuff. Looks like you brought me some more bolts, Mega Man. Alright, I'm making... Okay, well, alright. I was gonna... Whatever, nobody likes me. That's why I always die and stuff. Uh, anime analyzer, this is a power-up part for the transceiver. It... Oh, okay. Okay, so if we use the transceiver and that... This, this is that whole, like, Mega Man, Mega Man, did you know that this enemy is weak to this thing? Okay. Uh, super recover. This item will make it so that when you pick up recovery items, they'll restore more than four. All of it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, something else we mentioned. I don't know if I cut it out or not. You no probably e cut it no out. E probably. No E-tanks, probably. No E-tanks in this game. Yep, no energy tanks. You have to go without energy tanks, and nobody's a fan of that. Yeah, no E, W, S, M. none of them. M, none of them. Was there? I think there was an S. No, there was an L. There was an S. Yeah, there was an S. There was an A, um... Well, E, e, e is energy, W is, is weapon. weapon. M is, like, mega. So that's just all of them. Yeah. Then there was a, the L1, which is only sh showed up when Proto Man saved your butt from the fake Proto Man, and he filled your health up completely. And then the S1s were special tanks. I think they showed up in, like, 9 or 10 or something. To, like, replace, like, the M tank or something. Okay, counterattack. When you're in a bind, this will jack your attack power up quite so a bit. So you do damage when you do more damage when you're low on health. Yeah. Auto. This will charge up your shots even when you're not holding down the L button, the Y button. Okay. Interesting. For that just means you like never have to charge again. Cool. I think we'll just buy that for fun, please. Yeah, fifty bucks. Sure. You don't equip it on the parts, and you Uh, Eddie. This is Eddie. This is Eddie the delivery system. He'll bring you various items. Eddie's pretty cool. And rush search. You'll find and dig up hidden items for you. He'll act as your basic digger upper, so to speak. Uh, 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 but... And you need to use that in order to find a lot of CDs. Yeah, a lot of them. You don't put this part. Oh, that's the other thing that's kind of poo about this whole thing. Uh, you know the part system where you can kind of like equip various parts. Yeah. And all that. Uh, this game you can only equip one part at a time. Oh, but! Yeah, it's one of those things where it's like... Just like, uh, you got What's even the point, then? I have no like, idea. Like, you find one thing and go, I mean, this is it, the one thing I'm gonna buy. No use in buying hey, any... Bubble Man. Like, no use in buying anything else because I can't use it at the same time. Made for underwater combat, but through a design flaw can only move by jumping to Davy Jones Locker with you. Dave, what? Then expect Bubble Man to have a to Davy Jones Locker with you. Yarr. The first Pirate Man. Ups. Big Hearted. Downs. Spendthrift. I guess 
because he spends a lot. Okay. Likes hot springs, hates oil. No, I'll believe it. Yeah, no, that makes sense. He is a bubble guy, and oil does destroy bubbles easily. I think it's it. Oh, Venus. That's not Sailor Venus. This game lied to me. I... Oh, what was he from? One of the Game Boy games? Yeah, 5. Mega Man 5. Yeah, I was the, trying to the remember... Ro the planet robots. Yeah, I was trying to remember... His weapon... Yeah, he's basically Bubble Crab. Mm. Before I think they actually had Bubble Crab. If not, they were around the same time. His weapon, the Bubble Bomb, encases enemies in bubbles, sealing their movements. Yeah! Yeah! Uh, ups, be beautiful. Okay. Uh, there's only one character in yellow that I see as beautiful, and it ain't Venus. <laughs> oh, is it, Ogre? You ain't finding out for a long time. You can wait on that one. Look, just keep going, okay? <laughs> Downs. Bane likes good dan good dancer. He, uh, he, is he a crab. like he likes good dancers. Well, he's a crab. They're known for dancing. Yeah. Da hates. See, that doesn't say I likes dancing, or that, or like ups would be good dancer. No, it's likes good dancer. Dude likes good dancers. Yeah. It's, it's, that's why he doesn't like your playing, because you just ain't a good dancer. You gotta optimize your stuff. Hates octopuses, because octopuses eat the crabs. They just go up and crack their shells open and just go... Got them octopi. <laughs> I like how we're just gonna go like as octopi octopuses. All right. Um, so next time we're gonna take on Ground Man. Yeah. What did we do? One, two, we did, we three, did, four. Yeah. We did Burner Man. We did Pirate Man. We did that thing. Yeah. So we got the two down here. Yep. And they break up into two more robot masters. And Ground Man's gonna be. Well, that sounds exciting. It isn't. <laughs>